Triple J says yes. Check out our new and enhanced website at TripleJGuam.com. Get real-time view of every vehicle in our inventory. Instant trade-in plus easy financing. Triple J says yes. TripleJGuam.com. You mentioned about, you know, if someone was 18, why they should come out to vote. What if someone's like over 30? They have never voted in their life before. Why should they come out to vote now of all times? Um, many things are before us. Many important decisions are going to be made in the very near future. Those decisions are going to be made by our elected officials. These decisions will affect you and your children and your children after that. Guam is only 212 square miles big. Guam right now is made up of about 168,000 people. You, the 30 year old, is one of them. You are one of them. So whatever the elected officials, whatever decisions they make, it affects you. It's easy enough to register to vote and it won't take you an hour to vote. That's why you should come out. And how many, I think a little less than 50% or about 50% came out for the primary election, right? Yes, it was 49%. Uh, and what is your hope for, what is your, what is your hope for the general? Oh man, you know, um, we, we print 15% uh, more than what we had registered as of September 10th. So we're hoping that we get anywhere from, you know, high 50s to to 60s for um, uh, for as vo for voter participation. Um, we have an excellent slate of candidates, and we have very young candidates. Let's see what everybody can do, and let's see what you, the voters want who the voter who you the voters want to um, uh, to make those decisions for us um, we have one candidate that will turn 25 on the day of the inauguration so with, uh, with pushing for young voters it also seems like they're pushing yes, for young candidates yes. as well uh-huh and um, you know, um, as we as we're just weeks away from the general election, what are some reminders you want to give voters um, of what to bring, what to do, where to go? Mm -hmm. Give us a four one one on that. Okay, so come Tuesday, November eighth, two thousand sixteen, the polls will be open from seven o'clock in the morning to eight o'clock at night. Employers, please allow your employees to come out to vote. And please have them come out before they go to work or in early on. By the time it's 7 o'clock, it, you know, there may be a line. And it seems to be that there always is a line about 7 o'clock every general election. Then it, t then it takes a lot longer. Um, bring your photo ID. Um, if you need a ride, you know, contact your friends, contact your political party. They may be able to get you a ride. If you're a homebound voter, please call us now to let us know that you want to be serviced at home. Um, it, when you, uh, for those that come to the polling sites, if you want to come to the polling sites, but you have a, 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 a physical disability that prevents you from walking in comfortably, please know that we have curbside voting, which means your ID needs to get into the into your precinct. And if you have a family member in the car with you, have them bring it in. At the bigger polling sites, we're going to hire an additional usher so that those ushers will be waiting for potential curbside voters where they will assist the single occupant in the car to bring in their photo ID. Oh, that's a lot of information, but I know all of this is available at the, the, Chief, the Guam Election Commission's website. And can you give us some contact information and the website for people to go check? Our website is gec.guam.gov. You can call us at 477-9791. Um, you can also visit us at the second floor of the GCIC building here in Hagutnia. And 
if you're looking to be registered to register to vote most of our mayor's offices at this time have registrars we have a lot of community volunteer registrars out there their names and contact information are available on our website gec.guam.gov and I know we can't trust this enough. November 8th. November 8th, right? That's correct. <laughs> Tuesday, November 8th. We hope it's a beautiful, uh, windy day and nice and fr good sunshine so we can all come out. And what's that saying you guys keep um, putting out there? The slogan of the Guam Election Commission? Bota za un And And, you know, if you want to translate it is, your vote is your voice. And you definitely want people to be heard on, on Guam about what affects them and who they want to lead, help lead our island in the future. And remember, you know, you think Guam is a small island and we cannot vote for president, but Guam has been accurate 100% on who the next U.S. president will be. Oh, well, thanks again, Maria. I really appreciate the time in joining us for our cruising segment. We got to learn a little about you and get all these reminders about the general election coming up again on November 8th. Um, and I guess we'll be heading to the polls on November 8th and seeing what the results are. Thanks again for joining us. Sizu Usmaasi Ken and to the KUM group. Without you, with you, we will have a better election. Great, awesome. Thanks again, Maria. Thanks. All right. <laughs> have a nice day. Thank you. Triple J says yes. Check out our new and enhanced website at TripleJGuam.com. Get real-time view of every vehicle in our inventory. Instant trade-in plus easy financing. Triple J says yes. TripleJGuam.com.